Hello, I'm Uzair Karawana. In this video, I'm going to give you a quick overview of the Contacts module. The Contacts module gives you everything you need to know about a particular contact. Not only you see all the activities in one easy to use interface, you can also search for pretty much anything. So let's go into a contact. Over here you have all the contacts, details, the name, company name, telephone numbers, address, email, etc. Never forget tasks or things to do. Set reminders for all your tasks to be done on time. It's quick and easy. Click on the plus button. If you have the pro version, you can allocate different or multiple users. So we need to send a reminder for one of us to contact Ian Bell regarding this quotation. So I'm putting a due date and now that's sent it. With version 4, all the quotes, sales, purchases and events are linked to every contact. You can see instantly how often a transaction has taken place with a particular contact or a company. Keeping in touch with your contacts has never been easier. You can easily mail merge letters, send out graphic oriented HTML emails or print labels for a mail shot campaign. With Photo SF you can send out birthday or wedding anniversary greetings very very quickly and easily. It is quick and easy to search. With the campaign Allocate a lead or a contact to a particular marketing activity so you can track and measure the effectiveness of your marketing and advertising. Rate your contacts from 0 to 5, 5 being 5 star. If you wanted to send a box of chocolates or a bottle of wine to your best contacts, you can search this within seconds and print a list of labels. Grouping is very useful for target marketing. Say you attended a trade fair or a wedding exhibition. You receive a list of names and emails from the organizer which you can import into PhotoSF directly and group them and send out to only those contacts who visited your trade stand and not to the whole database. If you are a wedding photographer, you can enter the bride's name as well as the groom's full name here. So when you send out a communication to them prior to the wedding, both of them are addressed correctly.